Hello New Zealand, I'm Philip Duncan. Thanks for joining us for our weekend weather update and also the outlook through next week. And there are a lot of moving parts to the wind map today. Let me try and break it down for you. Obviously that's the main low pressure system, the storm that's developing out in the Tasman Sea. For the most part, that is an Australian system for the next couple of days. We have got a separate system which is also somewhat connected, but it is still separate. Here's another low pressure system that sort of spun off from this one. It is pulling away over towards New Zealand and we've also got these windy northerlies that are building in some areas which is mostly due to the exiting high pressure system rather than the incoming low pressure system. So there's quite a lot going on but really this is the main feature and it's this northerly flow up here that we think is going to bring in some pretty heavy rain across the weekend and early on Monday for some parts of northern New Zealand and maybe even the upper South Island and finally Australia they've got a big southerly blast, snow, heavy rain and a very strong winds as well, gales over there. So this is lunchtime Saturday and it is a very messy map. So we'll start with the storm out at sea, this is it. It is producing gale force winds, very big seas and also snow on the mountains over there. So a cold southerly, very windy gale force along the coastline and notice it is very coastal. Once you get inland a wee bit the rain stops and the winds also ease. Then you get this big kind of calm area in the middle of the Tasman, not a lot going on. And then you've got that secondary area of energy, that northerly flow coming in sort of between that low and the exiting high. And that's the area of rain we're monitoring. It'll be coming into northern New Zealand across Saturday afternoon. Many other areas not too bad. It might be a little bit windy through the mountains, but a patchy rain and drizzle around other parts of the North Island, otherwise actually fairly dry. Then we get to Sunday and it is a much wetter day. The deep low itself still well out in the Tasman Sea. The strongest winds wrapped around the centre and once again there's sort of a calm bit between the centre of that big low and the exiting high where we've got that windy northerly or nor'wester and the rain as well. So that heavy rain comes down right across the northern part of the country. Now amongst it there'll be patchy sort of normal rain, moderate rain and drizzle spells and even some dry spells in there too. But the rain that's heavy will be quite heavy and slow move, moving blocked by that high. The rain also comes down to the upper half of the north of the South Island, mostly Nelson and Marlborough but maybe parts of Canterbury as well. But it is fairly dry or completely dry for everybody else. Now we go back to work on Monday and that storm system is still out at sea. It is still out in the Tasman. So while it looks big, it isn't really directly affecting New Zealand until pretty much the start of next week. The weekend weather, that's it there. The really heavy uh, subtropical rain slowly moving away. Keep an eye on that. There could be some localised flooding and slips as a result of that area of rain. Most other places, it's just fairly normal, kind of unsettled weather, if you like. Then by Tuesday, the centre of that system still just off the west coast, but now the windier conditions around it are just starting to move in. So you'll feel the winds picking up and patchy showers or, or um, maybe a little bit of patchy rain coming in on Tuesday. And then by Wednesday, the centre of that system finally, after being around for a week, uh, finally starts to cross over the country and there's another day or so of weather coming in behind it. Colder southerlies too there, bit of snow coming for the mountains. So there is a lot going on. Once again, the main feature for New Zealand, heavy rain around the upper half of the North Island from Saturday lunchtime to probably the end of Sunday. It'll be off and on, there'll be dry spells in there too, but that's the main concern. There'll also be some heavy rain around the upper South Island too, but I still think the North is the one to keep a close eye on. Obviously keep up to date with any tax funded Met Service warnings and we'll be updating you over the weekend in case anything changes. It is a very big system after all. Have a great weekend, we'll see you back on Monday.